Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Bayonetta 3! Last time we did Chapter 7, Burning Sands, where we learned a little more about Viola and Luca. Things are getting weird, but today, Chapter 8, A Croaking Chorus. Let's go. All right, we're Bayo again, because Viola is going to be continuing to go after Luca to try to save him, rescue him, keep him from getting killed. I think she should just, you know, let, let just, just let him perish. Nobody's going to miss him. Really, nothing behind me. Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot. No, that's not the weapon I want. Oh my god, it's been a minute. I'm sorry, G-Pillar? I have no recollection of this. Raise tissue from the infernal demon Gamora. Oh, I just forgot what it looked like. Am I... What? No, yeah, that is... That. Huh. I guess I just forgot what it looked like. With the little accompanying demon. Um... Okay. Well... Let's see what the uh, train is all about. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. I love it. Oh, that's sweet! When we're dashing, we're a freaking train. It does not take a lot to impress me. So then, what does your dash look like then? Ooh. I like it. I like it. I do, I do. Okay. Wow, I've kind of been missing out on the little dash stuff, but it is what it is. I love the train. This is amazing. V very cumbersome, though, but... We deal with it. Oh, new enemy type? Or not? Or maybe so? Introducing. Castellanus. Ooh, you tall. This isn't that kind of game, buddy. I'm gonna have to take you out. Um... Hmm... This doesn't seem to be doing any damage. Do it. 
Ah. Okay. I love this weapon. I love it. Oh my god. Um... Oh my god. Look at this! So cool. Okay. Ouch. Wow, how did you survive? Ooh, crap. Yikes. Oh my god, okay. Got him. That was rough. That was rough. But we persevered. That's all that matters. Princess, you must not follow. Is that John? And Princess, you must be joking. Hmm. Also, what's that over here? There's a lot to find over here. Wasn't even paying attention to what they require from me here. Defeat all enemies. Limited terrain, tricky. Wait, limited time, tricky terrain. I'll see what it's all about. Oh, wrong button. Okay. Oh yeah, I think I do have a new costume that I should be switching to. So what makes the terrain tricky? Like that. Okay. All right. Great, great job. The shadow remains so yeah, I need to get the witch times. Why are you starting me all the way over here? Okay. Really?
Oh, come on. Um, my, okay. I'll give it one more attempt because this is a little rough. That was a witch time. Wow. Okay, yeah, I'm not going to try to grind this one out. I see what they want from me, but... Eh, your boy don't really got patience for that today. Oh, you can get some sick combos with this. Oh yeah, and then we're gonna do a little bit of uh I didn't have the money to buy it. Oh well we'll just well we'll we'll go back to standard Bayo clothes, why not? I am just all over the place right now. This place is huge. Oh crap. Why did y'all have to come back? Ah, okay. Got his ass. Wow. I am bad. These guys were the bane of my existence in Bale 1. Oh my god. <sighs> I can't stand them. That was awful. Somehow they gave me a silver. That was bad. Oh. Well, isn't that nice? You're an energetic little thing. It really is fun to just explore around in this game.
Oops. Doesn't really seem like there's much on those. Ooh, wait, what, wait, what are you? Okay. Wow, I'm just really good with her abilities. I want that treasure chest. Really? I'm just gonna be a little lazy some of my gun. I don't feel like trying to go for those right now. It's about time I got moving. Oh crap. I should be more careful. <laughs> I'm, why am I so bad today? Wrong button. Why? <laughs> oh my god. She ain't gonna make it. <sighs> okay, so what? Was I doing wrong there? Okay, I think I saw it like it said approach and push over. Realized that like mid run, so guess I just gotta push it over.
Um... Okay, I guess that's not what they wanted from me. Can this go quicker so I can, like, restart? Well, that's unfortunate. I also don't have a uh, red hot shot. Okay, so this is going off the rails. Get it because train. No, um. Okay. I do feel like I'm spending way too much time here. But A, I want to explore, and B, kind of want to give that area another shot. was I doing wrong besides everything? So what if I just get to it then and ride it. Because <clears throat> it seemed like it was... just floating on the sand. So far away. There we go. I have no idea if that was the intended way. But it worked. It's about time I got moving again. I feel like I am so lost right now. Dang bird. Okay, I'm not getting to the bird. 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 <sighs> All right. You got to be careful over here. Was hoping that was going to get the bird. <laughs> Yeah. 
What am I even hoping to accomplish? What am I doing? Oh, okay. This is a short level, though you wouldn't be able to tell with how I've been playing. <laughs> Oh, this has gone off the rails. Welcome to the gates of hell. Well, at least while we're here, uh, blue, 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 blue. no, I have one, so I guess sand is an instant death. I'll buy one of these. Oh yeah, I haven't been using the skills. I need to rectify that. Probably should not have used all my money on uh, Dems, but whatever. Ooh, ball statue though. Uh, not enough. I can wait on all that. Well, this was... Oh, I probably should have bought more lollipops. Now be fine. <laughs> this... What What is wrong with just me today? This is, this is not going amazingly. Oh, yeah, I could replace one of y'all with Train. I do like War Train, but it was a little... Yeah, we, we can bring War Train in. Yeah, I need to, like, do some stuff with this. Don't know why I didn't have Bat Within from the get-go. I should have been going here, like, sooner. Do they share the vitality? No. Might as well hook them up. What else you got? Full throttle. Shredder. R times two. That looks pretty good. It's only 400. Yeah, we can buy that. Ooh, we can unlock witch time for her. Okay, okay, all right. Upstroke. Chromatic Moon, my name is, all right, that sounds good. Star in the back, ooh. Okay, all right. These, I don't know if I'll end up using. I'll probably forget what their ability, or like what their inputs are, but might as well have them just to have them. I got more than enough. Down up kick. Wow, all this time I could have been like really pimping out my dudes. Okay. Okay, wow, yeah, there is a lot. 
that you can do. Extends Flutter Kiss Charm Duration. Reverse Tackle. Ooh. I'm liking, I'm liking all of this. Oh, I could have been making G Pillar better? Oh my God. Oh my goodness, I could have been like having everything going amazingly with these. Okay. We'll do that. Sure, why not? Cardiac wheelie. These 360 inputs. Yes. Yeah, I am definitely going to forget like half of these inputs. <laughs> oh my god. I also apologize for just how dull the last few minutes have been because it's yeah grace and glory y'all can just stay gone i don't miss y'all but yeah um hmm oh i can activate that okay cool 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 but yeah sorry that a lot of this was just reading but yeah, I've been missing out on a lot of stuff here. Uh, let's let's read about the demon's presence. As your fingers make contact, your head fills with the memories of someone else playing back as a series of images. You seem to be in a flight, but not aboard an airplane or even straddling a broom. In fact, you're holding on to the back of what seems to be a monstrous bird with exceedingly colorful feathers as it streaks through the air. On both sides are others in similar fashion on the backs of other birds as they fly in formation. Just a bit more, we're almost there. Look, that's where we'll set now. Hold on tight. The woman in the lead, riding on the largest bird in the flock, shouts to the others, gesturing far below toward what seems to be their destination, a tower surrounded by cliffs. The creatures plunge one by one towards the tower as if pulled in by its ominous aura, and the riders hold on with all of their strength to avoid being thrown. The birds show no sign of slowing as they approach the tower's summit. Their riders all brace for impact, but it doesn't come as the creatures spread their wings and slow down with practiced skill. Touching down with almost impossible gentleness, their riders have also been safely delivered. But nearly all of their faces betray exhaustion. However, one seemingly unfazed woman gives a clipped order. We must hurry. We still have a long journey ahead of us. Already seated from the fatigue of their flight, none of the others show signs of stirring. With a sigh, she simply states, if you continue to sit there, the wild ones will think it's feeding time. Immediately, the others' faces tighten and they stand, starting to descend the tower. She laughs heartily as she watches them go, following soon after. In a strange mixture of exasperation and satisfaction well up inside, the images fade from your mind. Huh. And, okay. Yep. It's the writer. Okay, just updating my info about them. But yeah, <laughs> okay. Sorry about things just slowing down to a crawl right there. But yeah, there is a lot to this game. They weren't Please, playing around with the turn. replayability. Leave this to me. Like just the level of customization you can do. Is this a cutscene? Okay. Like, it feels like I haven't even really cracked the surface of what you can do in this game. Is your grand scheme simply to bore me to death? 
I made it clear uh -oh. you were not to follow. And when someone gives me an order, I just have to disappear. You really are quite the headstrong. Do it. I'll have to force you to listen then. Prepare yourself. Unleash it. Take it. Get him, Gamora. But I guess that is the mark of a lot of uh, Platinum games, MO, just a really, oh my god, like fast paced, high intensity action game where, well that was unexpected. But yeah, high intensity, fast paced action game where you can pretty much play however you want. They give you a whole bunch of options, and it's up to you to really, like, play around, try out all the different weapons, all the different ways to play. And go from there. Sometimes you want to play better than how I am, though. Oh God. Do I got her? I thought I had her. Egyptian Princess Netta. Oh, hello, Frog. Introducing Ball. 
Does he always mess with a frog? Okay, um, I was admittedly looking up ball while that was going on. Um, I always thought that ball was a demon or a false god, but apparently it's a Hebrew, a Hebrew title slash honorific, meaning owner or lord. Uh, the Hebrew Bible includes use of the term in reference to various uh, Levantine deities although with an application towards Hadad who was decreed as a false god so yeah I always thought that was one god in particular but no it was just an honorific but okay oh yeah the symbol is a bull ram or thunderbolt okay I, I know I wasn't crazy I was like frog but all right anyway do it all right we got a tongue slap Okay, all right. <laughs> okay. Onward we go then. But yeah. I didn't really think about this until now, but I, this is more so just in terms of the LPs of Platinum Games, but where it's like, I don't really know how I should be handling these. Like, should I stick with one weapon in particular, like, and slowly learn how to excel at that weapon, or should I just keep trying out different ones and experimenting and having fun. Well, no. Do it. Cut down one and another pops up. I'm not here to pull weeds. That's how it gets done. Yeah, I think I will just stick with, like, trying out different weapons. Sure, that means my skills are going to be a little bit on the uh, questionable side. But I do like showing off everything the game has to offer. a lot of stuff and we got something over here booyah I'm just going with the flow don't know where I'm going in here but it looks like I'm about to be introduced to Radiatus. Radiatus. Do you like frogs? Do it. Do it. 
I don't think they like frogs. Okay, all right. How am I so bad at this? <laughs> Got him eventually. <laughs> oh man. I know it's been a minute since I last played, but I am not doing so hot today. I'm sorry, we get a triple jump? This place also seems very freaking huge. What? Okay. I accidentally solved the puzzle. Oh, crap baskets. Never mind. deserve to make that. Like, in the slightest. He can't keep getting away with it. Introducing. Murris. Murris? <laughs> Was that a High School of the Dead reference? If you know, you know. All right. Okay, that ice thing is annoying. Okay, homie means business.
I have no idea what I'm doing. More magic. Did I break your? I stunned you at least. Yeah, I think I broke your little shield thing. Okay, you mean business? Not my best showing. Not far, far from my best. That's amazing. <laughs> Frogs are such weird creatures. Yeah, that was Oh my combos were on point. The the, the damage though was not. Sure you'll be all right. Hey, <laughs> yeah, that that chapter could have gone better. Also, she's really gravitating towards these like alternate Jeans, as if they're the Jean she knows. But uh, or maybe she's just like becoming one with the bayonetta of that world when she enters it, and that's why she has the like. Just, just that strong bond towards Jean, because the Jean of this world did think that she was the bayonetta of this world. At least that's what I got from that little cutscene. But regardless, next time we're gonna be learning to fly. Is that gonna be an on rails chapter? Ooh. Also, stand on top of the windmill tower. Destroy five ball statues inside the temple. Enter the hidden room inside the temple. Hit a Castan, Casta, Castellanus core, while well, at least one segment is intact. Hit Murus with Ball's Poison Rain. Yeah, yeah, could have did better. But yeah, next time, Chapter 9, Learning to Fly. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day. See you next time for some more Let's Play Bayonetta 3. Goodbye. <laughs>